<laughs> hey, today was supposed to have been Harry Michelle's last meeting as a YSU trustee. I talked with him this morning and he told me he wasn't going even though there was a party planned for him. Now, First News anchor Stan Boney was at the meeting and found out why he left on such bad terms. Well, Harry Michelle graduated from YSU and during his years in the Ohio Senate, he says he brought over $100 million to the university. There's a building on campus named in his honor. He spent the last nine years as a trustee. Today was supposed to be Harry Michelle's last meeting, but his chair on the right side of the trustees room was conspicuously empty. A resolution was read in his honor. Both board president Carol Weimer and member Ted Roberts had nice things to say about him. But Harry Michelle missed the meeting on purpose, telling Dave that his biggest issue was with President Jim Trestle. No, I'm not going. I'm not going to put up with that people trying to demean you. That's all this governor, I mean, this uh, president's doing. He's demeaning the board, and I'm trying to tell him, don't put up with that nonsense. I'm not going back to sit through that crap, that nonsense. I didn't ever think we had a good meeting until there was a little bit of disagreement. And uh, so that's why he's been such a good trustee, is he's not going to sit and rubber stamp anything. Now, when I asked President Trestle if he was disappointed that Harry Michelle didn't show up, Trestle said, anytime we don't get to see Harry, I'm disappointed. Also at today's trustees meeting were 19 students of YSU's Computer Science and Information Systems Department wearing t-shirts that read, we need all of Michelle Hall. What their complaint was all about is coming up at 6. Live in the studio, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News.